हेलो स्टूडेंट बार वेलकम इन दिस यूट्यूब चैनल थ्री फोर्सेस एक्टिंग ऑन ए बॉडी आर सोन इन द फिगर टू हैव द रिजल्टेंट फोर्स ओनली अलोंग वाई डायरेक्शन मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द मिनिमम एडिशनल फोर्स नीडेड इज सो स्टूडेंट हियर वी रिक्वायर्ड फोर्स only in y direction then sum sum of fx force in x direction should be zero so we resolve the given forces here this is the force of 1 newton so its x component is 1 cos 60 and 1 sin 60 here is force of 4 newton its x component is this sin this is sin 30 4 sin 30 because If we take this, this is thirty, and this is cos thirty. Four n cos thirty. This is the uh, x component, and this is the y component. Okay, and another third three force, third force is two newton, which is this is thirty because these are vertically opposite angle, and therefore. Its uh, component in y direction is two n cos thirty, and this is two n sine thirty. Okay, so the total component of in x direction are one cos sixty plus two sine thirty minus Four sine thirty equal to zero. So one cos sixty is one by two. Two sine thirty is one by two. Four into sine thirty is one by two. So what we got? This is one by two plus one minus two, and this is three by two. Minus two. This is one point five minus two. This is point five. So minus point five should be added. So therefore, point five or one by two newton force is required to make the resultant in y direction. In y direction. Okay, so answer of this question is found in option C. I hope you got it. Please like the video, subscribe the channel. Thanks for.